Applied Behavior Analysis for the Treatment of Autism Spectrum Disorder Autism, a neurodevelopmental disorder that is characterized by social difficulties and inappropriate behaviors, was first identified in 1938, although symptoms describing the disorder stretch back hundreds of years. Investigation in the late 1960s revealed that autism spectrum disorder, ASD, a family of related afflictions, were separate from other mental disorders commonly originated in childhood. Patients characteristically exhibited an array of symptoms including the difficulty in developing nonverbal communication skills, delayed development of verbal communication skills, lack of empathic response, extreme focus on certain topics, repetitive behavior such as hand flapping or incessant rocking, the evolution of treatment for autism spectrum disorder. ASD was poorly understood and many patients with the disorder were misdiagnosed and typically treated with the limited range of therapies common to many mental disorders at the time, including LSD and other drug therapies, electroconvulsive shock treatments and other aversion therapies, institutionalization in mental institutions, psychoanalysis. Then came Dr. Ivar Lervis, a Norwegian American who graduated with a doctorate in clinical psychology from the University of Washington in 1958. Lervis' teachers had included a number of early subscribers to the app. Skinner's theories of behaviorism, including Montrose Wolf and Sidney Bijou. When he was hired as a professor at UCLA in 1961, Lervis was in a unique position to apply those theories in a series of studies in the treatment of autistic children. He established the UCLA Young Autism Project to investigate various therapy techniques rooted in behavior analysis. From this research, he proved the efficacy of a technique that came to be known as discrete trial training DTT, a highly structured series of steps leading patients toward an eventual behavioral goal. Mervis work both transformed the treatment of autistic individuals and helped to incontrovertibly establish the profession of applied behavior analysis as a scientifically validated therapy for a variety of behavioral disorders. Mervis was a major contributor to the founding of the Autism Society of America, a group that continues to advocate for ASD treatment and research today. Today, autism treatment and applied behavior analysis have become so closely tied together that most are only familiar with ABA in the context of autism therapy.